everyone. For stage two spelling this week, we have two focuses. The first focus is that we're learning all about the long A sound. And the second focus is actually a spelling rule. And this week's rule is the easiest one of all. It's about making plurals. And of course, we all know that plurals means more than one. And the rule, the very first rule about making plurals is for most words, all you have to do to make a plural is add S. Okay, so the long A, it makes the sound A. I say A, you say A. There are four different ways that you can make the sound A. You can make it by having an A or A with an I to make the sound A. And some of the examples are like aim, train, main, sail. Can you hear the A sound in those words? Another way that you, in English we make the A sound is that we have the letter A with the letter Y combined. And some examples of those words are today, play, stay. Another way that we can make the long A sound is where we have the magic E rule. So we've got B, A, K, L, A, T, S, A, L. And the final way is some words form the long A sound, just A by itself with random letters. And some of the examples are baby, paper, and game. I'd like you now to have a look at your spelling words and highlight all the words that you can see in those lists that have the long A sound. Our spelling rule, girls and boys, for this week, all our activities that we're doing, is, like I said earlier, one of the simplest ones. It's all about making plurals, and it says, most words add S to make the plural. And a reminder, a plural means, everyone, Yep, more than one. So lots could be two or more. For one, it's the singular. For more than one, it's we call it the plural. So the example is, if you had one apple and the word is apple, we just need to add the letter S to, to the end to make it two apples or more. Or you can have one pencil, and you've got the pencil there. To, have, to make the word pencils, which is the plural, you just add the S, which is looks like that. So I'd like you for your activity now, girls and boys, is to have a look at your list words. And in your book, I'd like you to convert any of the words that are in the list that can be formed into a plural. And I'll give you one example. It's the word week. One week converts to one or more, or oh, sorry, two or more weeks. So we just have to add S to the end. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy.